Hello everyone, and it goes Snake here, and welcome back to my channel. So as you can see, Chaos is spazzing out again. And we're on the quest for wherever the next save point is, because this is the last episode I'll be recording for this week, so it would be nice if I had a, like a good place to stop at by the end of this. So I already see enemies out here. Well, this looks interesting, though like you can see like space, the final frontier. Like, I think I see a comet slowly making its way around. Oh, I don't know what I just did. <laughs> what an amazing hologram. All observable space appears to be projected here. Really? All observable space? All observable space? I wonder what that black area is. It doesn't look like a black hole. I guess it's not quite all observable space. Lost Jerusalem. What? Wow. You know how Chaos is just spitting out random facts. Lost Jerusalem. We won't know what the fuck that means until never. Lost Jerusalem was once our homeland in the distant past, but no one can go near it now. Actually, nobody knows its location anymore. Okay, actually, he did describe it. Okay. So Lost Jerusalem is basically Earth. Um, it's, it's basically... Um, <laughs> uninhabitable as far as I know because he's like no one can go near it for some reason which is why we're all out here because I don't know something happened to earth probably climate change uh, and nobody knows his location however that looks like perhaps the ballpark area I mean looking at how this is all observable space like it is it is really really extremely scaled down because there's no way you can just look up and just see observable space like the entirety of it so this is tiny teeny tiny minuscule compared to what actual universe is so i can only imagine that it's not very helpful to say that it's like right there that's probably like thousands of years of searching right there <laughs> it could be that pitch black part there I've heard that the government has been working on a project to find Lost Jerusalem for quite some time. It looks like the radius of that black region is at least several hundred million light years. Yeah. Yeah, because that makes sense. It's like, yeah, there's like thousands, more like millions of light years. Of light years, not even just regular years, light years. Our homeland is somewhere in there. They never, the game never discusses why we can't go there anymore. It's just, it's very strange. That's one thing I was wondering when they said that. I was like, so why can't we go there anymore? <laughs> what, what, do, what do we do? How do we fuck it up? Let's already see the demons. Uh, Alright, let's just go around here. Like, let's fight these people. Once again, man, these enemies start to lose their minds once they get like really low on HP. And then they start doing all these moves trying to kill you. What does this do? Remove the lock? Sure. Okay, this better be bringing me to a freaking save point. Oh, I'm back out here again. And I think I can just- wow. I feel like I've gotten somewhere, like I jumped all the way down, then climbed back up to get back to this freaking stair area once again. Bane of my existence. But there's no more enemies out here and we can easily get to the save point that's on level 43. So, <laughs> wow, this is, they think they're being clever with the game. Like, oh, I know, we'll put a save point that's easily accessible from multiple areas of the game. You're not clever, get help. <laughs> Because what if you didn't do that? Like, I'm just checking out doors. <sighs> Alright, so let's keep going this way. So we're not buying the same battle battles multiple times. Hmm. Almost thought there'd be a segment door right there. But, there isn't. <laughs> huh, can't climb right there. Oh, there it. Ooh, segment door. What's this? Number six. 
So we found decoder six and number six all in the same area. So even if you hadn't got any of the other segment doors or been looking around, it would be difficult to miss this one. Trauma plates. Let's see what that does. That seems like a, seems useful. Cause that was traumatic. Not finding a save point until now. I need a trauma plate. All right, let's see. <laughs> uh, I'm here all day, guys. Uh, prevents critical hits. Oh my god. Oh, we need this. Oh, we need to put this on everybody. All right, so I have decided that I'm just going to keep using this party for the rest of the game because we don't have too much of the game to go if I remember it correctly. So we're just going to keep this party. So everyone has going to have critical guard and KO guard because I'm sure we're going to fight more demons trying to kill us as always. So literally, so literally, oh my god, let me look at, <laughs> literally, because <laughs> I'm turning into a valley girl or something. I don't know what's happening. But look at our segment foul, bro. Look at this. We only need to get the key to 16. And I think we missed it. I'm pretty sure we missed 16 because when are we going to have a chance? to get back to Waglin, 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 Day? I think it's Waglin Day. Like, when are we going to have the chance to do that? Because... Like, we have to get on a plate that has, like, an EVS thing. Are we going to find one of those save points around here? I just I have a sneaking suspicion we're not. <laughs> I think we should have gotten that a long time ago. <sighs> All right, so let's keep making our way across the room. Oh, was there really nothing right here to look at? All right. What? You don't know when to give up. We're just in a battle? I didn't even see what happened. Oh my gosh, I, I might have been moving too fast or something. I don't know, but that's fucked up. Once again, look, look at the game design. You can't walk into the room before you're in a battle. All right, let's, let's try this. <laughs> look like, if you look at the arena, it looks like we're out on the stairs again. Uh, physical attack up, that's not good. Um, okay. Well, let's do Mystic Nocturne. One against three. We should be fine. <laughs> right? Well, my man Chaos is down a little bit because the last fight, he was getting picked on. <laughs> Exclusively. Um, let's do a Floral Tempest. It's been a while. love to see it. That uh, doesn't seem too bad, like 1700. It's sort of a boss battle, but I think all the enemies have been up like 2000 HP or something. Alright, so I think it likes this. This is like the speedy person, so I'm gonna do um... Speed machine. And we're just gonna go next. <laughs> this. Speed machine is already working, <laughs> apparently. What kind of ether do you have? Okay, just healing stuff. He's already boosting. Counter boosting, by the way. Every enemy can counter boost. Wow. 
so much damage. It, I mean, it's a little ridiculous. It's a little ridiculous. But I mean, I guess it does as much damage against us as we do against it. It just has more HP. <laughs> Just, just takes away casually, takes away. Oh my gosh. Um, all right, Mystic Nocturne. Let's go. Yes. So it has 400. Let's do a live shot on Momo. <laughs> Chaos can do Momo's ether move better than Momo. <laughs> and that's what we got from that. Good. Alright, so we're gonna wait till we get to our lovely slot and then destroy the fuck out of it. <clears throat> oh, it keeps boosting right when I don't want it to. Um, what should I do? I'll guard this time. Oh, that's that's pretty intense right there. Hopefully, we will just boost when we get the chance. Cause this seems like a good battle to do the the point slot on. Okay, quickly, quickly. Yes. All right. Cool. We got it. Um. 121, it is dead. We have a lot of tech points. We should probably start using that or something. <laughs> we didn't get a lot of like ether or skill points, just a lot of tech points as usual. I guess they want all of our tech our tech attacks to be up. <laughs> All right, cool. So, are we out here? Oh, we can't. Oh, of course not. Using the stairs, get the fuck out of here. Well, I guess you've been using the stairs, but it would just be too easy, because I think that's where we need to go. But let's use some items here and heal ourselves back up. I might also use some of these tech points. Um, Stick Nocturne will bring it up like two levels. That's that's a good thing, right? Um, okay, so I've upgraded levels on everyone's tech attacks, so they should be doing more now. Let's find another one of these speed monsters. Wow, I made that go on for way longer than it needed to because I kept miscalculating the amount, the hit I needed to do, the HP damage I needed to do. Ooh, a cutscene. Kinda. This is the room where I was born. What? This is where you were. never told me what this facility actually was responsible for during the Milshin conflict. But I think I know. When I was born, Daddy died. That vision was true, and what happened afterwards was... Like mommy said, this is an abominable machine. A lot of people died because of my birth. Does that mean I'm an abomination as well? Just like daddy? Mama. Okay, I don't I don't think people died because you were born. No! I don't understand. 
Shion? Even though you're a Realian, you're still their child, right? No parent would ever think of their own child as abominations. Surely, there can't be any. That's that's a little naive, uh, Shion. I have to say. I mean, you see, you hear about. Oh my God, we're already in a fighting. Look at this. But anyways, yeah, it's, it's a little naive to think that, you know, there are no parents out there who think any differently than, than other parents. Like, there are shitty parents out there. They exist, Shion. Let's... Grown-ass woman, Shion, doesn't think there are shitty parents out there. Like, there could be people watching this video one day that had shitty parents and are like, what is she talking about? And also never understood why Momo was like, well, because I was born, a lot of people died. No, a lot of people died because other people put events into into motion okay i don't think it had anything you you had no no like you had nothing to do with the situation that's i mean you were just born like there was uh, what am i trying to say i'm trying to say that you had no control over what happened so things didn't happen because you were born things happened because other people put certain events into motion so i just that's also naive Xion's the naive and and no one was out there to be like like ziggy couldn't have stepped in and be like guys just this the naivete is is getting to unbelievable levels right now why like what the conclusions that we're we're jumping to the leaps of logic right now but anyways we're just we're out here again ah we're gonna fight these people there's so many of these <laughs> All right, so we're making our way around. All right, let's just fight this guy. <laughs> Feels good to get all those points every single battle. <laughs> Even if it does take a little bit longer to do. So where were we? Okay, uh, all right, so we made it all the way to the other side. Use the elevator? Why, yes, of course. I, I really hope there's a save point down here. Like, I keep, I keep saying there's definitely has to be a save point, but it's not the same one from the stairway. But I could just, oh yes, here we, yes, yes. Okay, so, yeah, we are, this is, this is the last save point of the entire game. Just want to put that out there for you. So we have, whatever segment door six was, I totally missed it. I can't fucking believe it. I thought we'd get all the segment doors. I've gotten that one before, but I, I already, I already don't know what that was. It, it's not a robot part. It, it wasn't, it's probably not anything too significant because I got the, the double buster whatever thing. So let's check out our skills here. Um, so the thing that we really wanted, I really wanted to get was um, the double buster. There it is. Yeah, we, we want people to get the double buster. Um, yeah, if you get the double buster and you have the commander's crest, you're, you're a badass. <laughs> I think everyone can get it though, and if they can't, I think I have a uh, skill upgrades and all of that. Let's check. Okay, well, I don't have that much. Like this is 50 and that's 10, so I don't really have a lot of skill upgrades. But I think we actually have a lot of skill points. So yeah, he can. He's not gonna do it because <laughs> he can do. Um, he can do. Uh, you know, counter boosts. I'm gonna have Chaos and Momo be able to do the double buster. Wait. Mm, okay, let me see. How much skill points? Oh, they don't have enough skill points. I would have to um, grind a little bit to, to be able to get it, actually. Um, how much? How much is it? How much? <laughs> hope it's not a lot. 
Okay, 300. And, well, 500, really. And Junior's the only one who can really, like, get it instantly right now. Because he has five, he at least has 500. Then he could put Commander's Crest on him. <sighs> so, alright guys. I might be doing some grinding in the future. I'm probably going to go back upstairs and do grinding. Probably off screen so I can get people up to my optimal levels. Um, Because Double Buster is pretty cool. I want to show you guys what the fuck that's like. I think maybe I've shown it earlier, but... Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be some some grinding going on. It's not my favorite thing to do. Well, scratch that. It's I'm fine with grinding. You know, I love. It's kind of like a, I kind of like a very. What am I trying to say? <laughs> it's kind of like a relaxing thing to do, you know, while also listening to music and doing other things and stuff like that. I don't know. It's very nostalgic for me, grinding. Um, as long as it doesn't go on forever and ever. <laughs> Which, this game, as much as I bitch about it, and there's some parts in this game where it will fuck you up so hard. Like, like dungeons where the level just increases exponentially within the dungeon. Um, or you go on to the next one and you should be like 10 levels higher. <laughs> Um, it doesn't explicitly tell you about all the things in the game. Like, it doesn't tell you what each move actually does, and you have to see what it does on screen just to figure shit out. Nothing about counter boosting. Like, it's a lot of things this game doesn't directly tell you. It doesn't hand- it doesn't hold your hand, let's just say. So, that's- that's one thing about it. I- it's very endearing, though. Like, you get better at the game the more you do it. Like, there are- there are pathways to winning. Um, the more you do it, and it it's rewarding when you can figure out how to do it on your own. So there there's that, um, and the grinding isn't so bad. Um, I think I've had a game that's worse than that, like Final Fantasy XIV, the MM MMO RPG. Um, that one, that one had at least when when it first came out, they I'm sure they've updated it and all of this. When it first came out. The entire time I was grinding and grinding and grinding just to get up to the right level to to be able to progress because there were certain like dungeons you had to do with uh, with other like characters that you couldn't do until you got to a certain level or it was it would have been very difficult to do so that game what is the worst the worst offender and and excessive grinding but this game is not so bad you could potentially grind more and more um, to make the game easier, but I think level 40 is actually a good level to be at to finish the game. I just personally want to use Double Buster. Um, and there are other skills, like if you get to skill level 5, you can get certain certain things, but I've never gotten skill level 5 in this game, and it's not it's not necessary. That's, that's for if you are bored and, and you just feel like it. So, I'm gonna stop rambling on and on. We're gonna end it here, and we're gonna see... I don't know. The, I don't think the next one is gonna finish the game. I, I think I still have like maybe at least three more episodes, three or four more episodes left in this game because it's very long-winded. Even if that is the last save point right there, you still have a lot of game left. <laughs> this is a lot of game left to do, and this game is very scarce for the save points. So, see you next time. See you next week, everyone. Bye bye.